Hey guys, welcome to episode 15 of my Houston Texans Connect Your Career franchise here on Madden FL 25. And in this episode, we'll be going up against the Pittsburgh Steelers at home in the Reliant Stadium. And on the season, the Steelers are 9-1. They only have one loss, and they have the third-ranked defense, I believe, and the first-ranked offense, or vice versa, I think. So this will be a tough matchup at home, and we're looking up to pick... Up a very nice win on the season. This would be big for us if we're going to beat a 9 and 1 team. And right now we are in first place in our division by, I believe, a game and a half over the Tennessee Titans. There you can see Josh Johnson, 2,200 yards, 19 touchdowns, 6 interceptions, 16. And now on first and 10, Josh Johnson does the read option. He fumbles, and a bunch of people are going to miss the ball, but end up David Cuisenberry picks it up the left guard, and he picks up 4 yards. That's a strange way to start off the game right there. So on a thir early third down, third and four, the ball is batted down by Cameron Hayward, and we're gonna be forced to punt. And like in Madden, like when you do franchises, it feels really weird to go up against your favorite team. It's like you don't want to beat them, but you do. So that's how I kind of was feeling in this game. But you know, I was gonna be playing just to get the win. And Le'Veon Bell does a spin move, a juke move, it gets to. The 44-yard line, he gained 17 on that play right there. And on second and six, Ben Mossberger evades the sack, does a spin move himself, and picks up the first down. See, he's a very good scrambling quarterback, and we're going to have to watch out with that today. And on second and one, he's going to go deep into the end zone, and it is incomplete. It was a 10-4 Antonio Brown, but Josh Johnson, not Josh Johnson, Jonathan Joseph ended up batting it down. And now on third and one, they do pick up the first down on a big run play right there. That was 11 yards. So now, second and five on the eight yard line. We need to get a red zone stop right here. Ben Mossberg, drop back to throw. He does find Antonio Brown and he does find himself in the end zone. First six, and that's going to be the first touchdown of the game. And the Steelers are going to go up seven to nothing. That's not how we want to start off the game. We, fought, we had a punt away, and then the Steelers are going to score in their first possession. So we're looking to score right here. Josh Johnson, drop back to throw. And he does find DeAndre Hopkins on the out route. To pick up a gain of about 10 yards, maybe 12 yards. So now we were driving down the field. First and 10 on 31. Josh Johnson play action. And he's going to roll out to the left. And he's going to find Owen Daniels. And next week, Ryan Griffin does come back. The rookie. This is his rookie season. But he did go down with an injury in the beginning of the year. So when he comes back, I don't know what I'm going to run. I think I'm still going to run with Owen Daniels at the starting time. And even though Ryan Griffin was the starting and right there, you can see Josh Johnson does find Kemperl Tompkins, who gets down on the... Oh, no, he does score. So, we're going to tie it up at 7. So, yeah, like I was saying, I think I'm going to roll with Owen Daniels. And maybe one of two tight end sets sometimes. Twin tight ends. I don't know. So, an early third down. Almost to go three now for the Steelers. He, Ben Roethlisberger, is sacked by Brooks Reed. Loss of a good gain. And that's going to make them punt on a 4th and 19. Our defense come, came up big right there. And we're going to be forcing them to punt. So we have a chance to take the lead for the first time in this ball game. We are in the second quarter. And now second and nine. Josh Johnson dropped back to throw. And he does find Kemperl Tompkins who evades the tackle and gets up the field. He's got four catches for 39 yards in this ball game. And in this game, Kemperl Tompkins definitely was our best receiver. As you can see when in the game. And also, this team has one of the best ranked defense in the league. And it was really hard to run on them. So it's second and three. Dropping back to throw. And Josh Johnson does find Andre Johnson who holds on. On the 10 yard line. Now, first and goal. And now it's third and goal. Drop back to throw. Josh Johnson's looking for Kemble Tompkins, but he's picked off by Lamar Woodley. It was intended for actually DeAndre Hopkins, and that's not what we needed right there. But after a punt away by the Steelers, we get it on about the 30 because they were backed up in their own yard in their own territory. So now um, we're on the 13 yard line, a third and five. Josh Johnson drop back to throw. He's looking, he's rolling out to the right. And he's going to keep on rolling out to the right. And he's going to dive. And he's down on the one. And when we're on the one, well, actually, it's second and goal. But we're just going to hand it off to Arian Foster to pick up the touchdown. And it is 14-7 in this ball game. Our defense is keeping us in this game. So now it's second and 10. Ben Rosberg's job back to throw. He does find former Oklahoma State Cowboy, I believe, Marcus Sweden. I think he went to Oklahoma State. I'm not sure there. But now first and 10 on the 37. Ben Rosberg's job back to throw. And he does find Marcus Whedon once again. And um, the uh, as I'm recording this, it is Wednesday, the 23rd, I believe, of April. And the NFL schedule does come out 
tonight for I believe all 32 teams and I'm really excited to see who the Steelers play because I usually go to one Steelers game every year since I do live in New York and they do play in Pittsburgh I usually go to a home game every year for my birthday me and my dad go but it right there Captain Mylon does pick it off it was intended for Antonio Brown but Ben Rossberg instead find Captain Mylon for the first turnover of the ball game and yeah because last year I did go to the Steelers Ravens game in Pittsburgh and the Steelers did win 1916 I believe on a game winning field goal so that was really cool to see and this year we're going to be seeing who we're going to be see playing they do play I believe the Saints at home the Falcons at home and they usually play all three division rivals well they do play all three division rivals and then on Ben Rosberger was looking to come back but he does go three and out and right here we're going to put Ken Brawl Tompkins on the streak route first and ten Josh Johnson throws it up and is hauled down by Kemperl Tompkins. Like I said, Kemperl Tompkins was our best and most effective receiver in this game. And there you could see him celebrating. And I was really surprised how good we were scoring on this third-ranked defense, I believe, in the NFL. Now on second and nine, Ben Mossberger is looking for someone. And he's going to find no one because he is sacked by Whitney Merciless. Now it's going to be a third and 13. And they need a first down right here. They're going to run the screenplay to Le'Veon Bell. And Le'Veon Bell could get the first down. But no, he's hit out at the one. And on fourth and one. So they would end up picking up the first down. After they went for it on fourth and one. And now third and eight. We're in the fourth quarter now. And Ben Rosberger does find his receiver. For a gain of nine yards. And now first and goal on the five. Ben Rosberger is looking to throw. And he does find Antonio Brown once again. And now they're back in this. They're only down by one touchdown. It's 21-14 to 14 now, and they do need a stop. And we need to pick up a first down here. On a third and six, we hand off to Arian Foster. And he makes a nice juke move, and he does pick up the first down. There was two defenders in front of him. But right there is going to seal up the game. We're going to have to kick a field goal because of clock management. And, yeah, 25 seconds. They need two scores, and that's not likely going to happen. You're going to see Ben Rosberger ends up throwing a pick at the end of the game. And yep, your final score is 24 to 14. Josh Johnson did have the pick if you were uh, not Josh Johnson, I keep confusing him. Jonathan Joseph did end up having the interception if you were wondering. And yep, that would be it for the video. Like if you enjoyed and comment, subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys in the next video.